sit down, I'll be able to write a chapter for a book. How to take the joy out of sex. Talk about turning a perfectly wonderful experience into a nightmare of fear and anxiety. Where is it? You have to be a lab technician. Here we go. Your temperature remains elevated for 14 days after ovulation. What can I do for you, Mr. C? Well, you've done so much for me already, I don't know how to thank you. Well, just see you need and smile on again is thanks enough. Well, I guess you told you that I'm trying to get the family together again. Yep, and I couldn't be happier to hear it. Some of the better as far as I'm concerned. Anything I can do to help speed up that process, you just let me know. That I appreciate, and without pressing my luck, there is a favor I want to ask you. Name it. Evidently, forensics found these bones that were thrown under my boathouse. They do not belong to Hal Clark. Yeah. Apparently somebody was murdered, body thrown under my boathouse. I want you to find out who. Ever since before Mexico. I oh, think. I know. Well, one thing's for sure, we're certainly going to be sore tonight. Mm. Well, what do you say? You want to take that three mile run we used to do? Or the... We should try five. We could do five. What? Are you kidding? I thought we were going to take it easy first day out. Oh, well, what did you have in mind? Hey, would you quit with the <laughs> chips? <laughs> More like a brisk walk. A brisk walk? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> what is with you, Castillo? Is this what married life has done to you? Turned you into a delicate little house flower? I think you better be careful. I still have thorns. <laughs> All right, touche. <laughs> so let's go. Hey, hey, oh, 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 I can't oh, have oh, any, oh. you can't have any. <laughs> How to get pregnant? Are you kidding? I'm, not, I'm pretty sure there's only one way. Evie, <laughs> are you pregnant? Uh, well, uh, yeah, I really didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait a minute. Come on, Andrea, I don't know. Are you? That's wonderful. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah. Well, you guys have all the fun. Uh, yeah. What'd you find? You're kidding. No, to tell you the truth, man, nothing our DA does or does not do surprises me anymore. Well, tell me what you need. Maybe I could come up with something. Yeah? For an ID? Well, I'll try. Okay, yeah. Yeah, th thank you, Zach. Okay. What's new? Well, you won't believe this, but it, it, it seems our friend, who we laughingly refer to as the district attorney, hasn't done a damn thing to identify those bones I found under the boathouse. Oh, come on. You didn't expect any more from Timmons, did you? No. Hey, why are you following through on this? Well, Mr. C wants to know who was shot and buried on his property, and I think he has every right to uh, and want to investigate that, don't you? Well, sure, but how are you going to find that out? I mean, forensics can't ID the, the remains without medical records or dental records uh, for comparison. Yeah. And how are you going to find those unless you know who it is? I know, I know. So where do we start? Well, we should start by thinking about this. What do you think? I think we got to go start at the beginning. we got to go to the missing file, uh... From around that time the body was dumped. Yeah, but do you have any idea how enormous a proposition that would be, presuming that the guy was around here in the first place where he came from? Yeah, but, I mean, what other choice have you got? You can, you know, you go to the computer, you put it in, and you see what comes out. I suppose that is one area we could attack. Well, you have a better suggestion? Well, I was thinking of going back to uh, Basic Detective 1A. Oh, let me get in my Basic Detective 1A position. Well, don't let me interrupt your nap there, Kane. No, just talk softly. I was referring to uh, starting at the beginning, you know, like checking and rechecking the scene of the crime. Oh, we're not going to go back into that sludge, are we? Well, I'm not. I already did my time in that sludge. I was thinking of, uh... No. You. Hello, Princess. Good morning. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm um, as good as I've been in a long time. Well, I'm glad. 
I am determined to bring this family together. That's why. Well, that makes me really <laughs> glad. Do you know how much I love you? How proud I am of you? Thank you, darling. Thank you. <laughs> and you are my first reclamation project. You are the first step towards exactly what I said, building this family. Me? How mm -hmm. so? Well, I've been doing some thinking, see? And, uh, but everything, but everyone. And I've come to the conclusion that I miss you in my business, and I want you to come back to work for me. Well, I don't, I don't know. Oh, darling, please. I mean, you are the smartest, the shrewdest, the most charmingly tough businesswoman I've ever worked with. Wow. Come on, now. Huh? Well, I'm serious, too. I, I want you to come back to work for me. Well, Daddy, I'm really flattered, but Well, I, then just say yes. I can't. What? Why, is your mother going to be upset if I asked you no, to do that? No, 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 not at all. I mean, Kelly went to work for her. There's no issue about taking sides anymore. Well, then why not? Just say yes, then. What, what? I can't. Why? Because Cruz and I want to have a baby. Oh, oh baby, that's great. Mwah, mwah. <laughs> that's wonderful. Well, now there'll be more of you to work with. <laughs> Look, I'll be, I'll be very flexible. I'll, I'll make the hours any way you want it. You can take maternity leave. You can come back when the baby's born, even if he's uh, going into high school, whatever. Daddy. I mean, I'll accommodate anything you want. I'll accommodate the job, even. Just pick the job you want. I'd huh? Love to. I mean, think of all the business opportunities you can choose from. You can... What did you say? I said yes. I'd love to. Oh, baby. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> I was the smartest, the best businesswoman, the greatest... Oh, it sounds even worse when I tell it. <laughs> Why are you so surprised? Every word of it is true. Oh, come on. Don't you think he's a little prejudiced? Not a bit. Hmm. Just like you. Eden, your father is one of the shrewdest businessmen in the country. You think he would jeopardize his own success by placing anyone of less than sterling ability in a high-level executive position? Never. He just made me feel irreplaceable. Well, I've always told you you were irreplaceable. No, now, come on, be serious. I'm, not, I'm completely serious. <sighs> I took the job. Really? Yeah. Well, congratulations. That's, that's Are great. Are you happy? Yeah. I'm really excited. I, I mean, this is really going to be a challenge. There are really a number of positions, important positions. He thinks I might be suited oh, okay, for. Okay, okay, but I have to ask you a question. Fire away. What has gotten into you? What do you mean, what's gotten into me? I'm happy. I'm excited. Uh-huh. But it's it's something more than that, isn't it? I mean, what, uh, um, what's, what's going on here? Well, maybe it's the uh, glow of success. No, that's that's not it. Uh, the uh, heady feeling you get when you rise up the corporate ladder? Uh, <laughs> no. No? No. Well, then, why don't you tell me what it is? No, why not? You tell me what it is, because something is different. Well, why would you think that anything is different? Well, because... Because why? Just... Uh, because... never did tell me, you know. Tell you what? Why you're so different today. Yes, I already told you. I'm happy. I want to know the real reason, Eden. Okay. You are the biggest reason. Well, I don't believe you. But how can I not accept that? Did I, did I ever tell you how I feel about um, picnics? No, as a matter of fact, you didn't. Well, I like them a lot. You do? Mm-hmm. I think they're highly, highly stimulating, actually, as a rule. Seductive, maybe? Is that what you had in mind? Just a side dish. That was my favorite. So would you like me, for me to continue this tradition? Yes. 
Every day, alternate Thursdays? Every day, if not more often. Yeah, turn over here. <laughs> turn back over here. Hi. We were, uh... Uh, what's going on in here? Having lunch. Lunch. Oh, yeah. Lunch. So I see. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so, uh... The door was locked so the ants couldn't get in. Yeah. You hit it right on the head. They got this new strain of uh, South American bodybuilding ants. Oh, yeah. Now. You yeah. let them in, they eat your picnic and oh, march yeah. your desk right out the door. There's a line of them right out there. <laughs> so, uh, what'd you find at the boathouse? Not much of anything yet. Yeah, it's going to be slow going. There was a lot of debris kicked up by that explosion. You say something, darling? No. Well, I'll make another dive uh, this afternoon. Yeah, I hate to ask you to do it, man, but I think it's uh, pretty much our only choice, although I... I <clears throat> did have one other area I wanted to explore. Wilson, Arvin, um, disappeared, 7-4-86, 7 p.m. Arvin. Arvin. Nice name. 7-4. Deceased, DOA, 7-3-1987, approximately 3 a.m. Scratch that one. You know how long we've been at this? Oh, come on, it's not that late. Why don't we just get through this page? Unless you want to take a break right now. Well, you know, these things get a little difficult to read after a while. Computer printouts, you know, they're, they're dots. Okay, break's over. What are you talking about break's over? I didn't have any chance to rub my eyes yet. Let's just get through July, okay? That'll make a half a year's worth of records we've been through. Yeah, right. Without one lead as to who is buried under the boathouse or even uh, unaccounted for. Cruz, we just have to keep at it. What? Why are you here? I'm here to help you eliminate the people who aren't buried under the boathouse. No. What are you really doing here? You have been hanging around like a puppy waiting for his master to get out of school all day. Now, what's with you? Excuse me, puppy? And, uh, master? Huh? What are you talking about? You want to tell me something or what? You're like the cat who ate the canary. Why do I feel like I suddenly entered a pet store? Eden, don't make a joke. Okay. As a matter of fact, I want to... Yes, yes, yes. Oh. I'm sorry, am, am I interrupting something? I, no. I, I'm not sure what it is, but I found something. What? It's one of those uh, medical uh, ID bracelets yeah. people wear when they, they've got... Shoot, medical pro... Oh, I've got it. The problems. Where did you have uh, a, uh, had somebody's name, name on it? Yeah, I did. Right there. I didn't recognize whose name it was, but. Is this what you always do with evidence? <laughs> I had it. Oh my God. 